Michigan State with the win, but they had to do it in comeback fashion over Iowa, outscoring the Hawkeyes by 20 in the second half, an 80 to 73 final. With the former Maryland Terrapin, Christy Winter Scott, I'm Lisa Byington. Michigan State needed a focus. They were coming off a loss against Indiana on Wednesday, and they needed to focus. They got that focus, especially in the final 20 minutes. They did. The second half was the biggest difference in this game, and they turned it up on the defensive end, which allowed them to score in the paint. They had a 36 to 22 advantage in that area, and I really think it was a concerted effort coming out of the halftime locker room to attack the rim, and that's exactly what they did. Ariel Powers had 21 points. Of her 23 points on the afternoon, in that second half alone. I was going to say it wasn't good for the Iowa Hawkeyes when she, she only had two at the break because you right. knew something was coming in the second half, and boy, did it come. Well, Ariel Powers was simply phenomenal. It started on the defensive end where she was able to get steals and scores for her team. She plays with such passion. She knocked down a lot of shots from the outside as well, but she also got isolations, finished with contact inside, created space off the mid-range jump shot, and the Spartans are here at home with the victory. 23 points, seven rebounds. As you mentioned, 21 of the 23 coming in the second half. It definitely was a tale of two halves and it went Ariel Powers in the Spartans way. Well, one of six for Ariel Powers in the first half. Seven of nine in the second. So effective and efficient. Seven of eight from the free throw line as well. No free throws in the first half, and that shows you that she changed her mind in terms of her attack mode. At one point, Iowa led by as many as 16, and then Ariel Powers did what Ariel Powers does. Spartans had some fun, and they come out victorious, 80 to 70.